And 2024 is the final battle. That's going to be the big one. If you put me back in the White House, their reign will be over, and America will be a free nation once again. Our enemies are desperate to stop us because they know that we are the only ones who can stop them. They know that. You know, there's never been a movement like this in the history of our country, probably in the history of almost every country. MAGA, make America great again, America first, go, whatever you want. But I will tell you, there's never been in history, look at this crowd, as far as the eye can see, we flew over, it was a beautiful sight, as far as the eye can see. And I did tell you, great Lieutenant Governor, I said, you know, Dan, let's not do one of those 50-50 areas or an area we're a little behind. Let's go right into the heart of it. Come on, let's go. Let's go where we were close to 100 percent, right? That's what we did. But as far as the eye can see, the abuses of power that we're currently witnessing at all levels of government will go down as among the most shameful, corrupt, and depraved chapters in all of American history. It's happening right before your eyes. But we're going to end up winning. The Biden regime's weaponization of law enforcement against their political opponent is something straight out of the Stalinist Russian horror show. And you know, we go Stalinist Russia. That's what it was. This was where it seems to have begun from the standpoint of us watching it in semi-modern day history. You go back to communist China or look at a third world banana republic. That's what we've become. Between our borders, our elections, and the weaponization of law enforcement, banana republic. That's what we have become. Let there be no doubt the injustices being done, not only to me, but to dozens across our country will not stand, and we're not going to stand for it. When this election is over, I will be the President of the United States. You will be vindicated and proud, and the thugs and criminals who are corrupting our justice system will be defeated, discredited, and totally disgraced. That's what's happening. That's what's happening. From the beginning, it's been one witch hunt and phony investigation after another. And you know, because of it, our country never talks about greatness anymore. You look at what China does. They go all over the world. They spend money, they take over governments, they do a lot of things. And we're always looking. We got crazy people like Schiff, Shifty Schiff, and Hillary, and all of these people. These people, they don't want to talk about greatness for our country. All they want to do is investigate everybody, but they are the ones that are really under investigation. I also want to thank the Republican Congress, because, you know, people can be critical, but they are working so hard. Jim Jordan, James Comer, he's become a great star. These are great people. And 